In the picturesque neighborhood of Hopewell Hills, we find the Michelsons. A recent addition to the family has instigated an unexpected and uninvited guest, the doting grandparent. Tonight, we'll use this temporary stay to explore the family dynamic, the milestones that define one's life, the personalities that can connect us or push us apart, and how all of it is simply a matter of perspective. Let's first examine the married couple's reaction to Celeste's father's unannounced arrival. Fortunately, their family dynamic is set to close, as if hand-picked for them. This relationship setting, if you will, has stood the test of time, thanks to the social compatibilities they share. Throw in the many milestones they've achieved together, the joy they have for Orion joining the family, and they seem to be genuinely embracing Sebastian's help in growing their family together. Sebastian is very protective of his daughter, which is why he's even more critical of Christopher. There's nothing wrong with Christopher, per se. He and Sebastian just have different interests and ways of expressing themselves. Sebastian has lived a long, fulfilling life. The dude's old, that's, that's what I'm saying. But he still has much to learn, especially when it comes to the man who makes his daughter happy. <laughs> Orion's recent arrival has sent the family dynamics into a tailspin, causing everyone to adjust. But she's a baby. She's got better things to do. After all, an infant's world is full of firsts, and there are other firsts yet to come. Atlas, the once king of the castle, how he misses the days when he had his parents wrapped around his little finger. Fortunately, he has always had a great relationship with his grandpa Sebastian. These two troublemakers might as well be the same person. And as far as Atlas is concerned, this old jokester has come to play with him, not the enemy. The family dynamic is not something easily defined. But growing together through all of life's many surprises means understanding everyone has a different point of view.